Hello, I'm Greg Kendrick with Way West Lighting and Camera in Laguna Hills, California. I want to go through the Alexa menu with you just a little bit, particularly looking at codecs. We're going to start here at the menu. We're going to go into recording, recording the 64 gigabyte SBIS Pro cards. The codecs you can choose are either Apple ProRes or Avid DNX files. If you choose Avid DNX files, you can choose the following 8-bit bit rates or the following 10-bit bit rates. The more, majority of my clients shoot Apple ProRes. You can shoot proxy files, light files, regular 422 files for your corporate clients that want to deal with high quality images but small file sizes. These are all 10-bit by the way or ProRes 422HQ files, which is what the majority of my clients shoot. If you're going to be uh, effects heavy in your project, you can shoot ProRes 444, and this is a 12-bit codec. Resolution HD is 1920 by 1080, or you can shoot 2K, it gives you a few more lines for repositioning in post. If we were shooting a movie, we'd probably shoot 2K. Generally, we stick with 1920 by 1080. Gotta come out of this, go to the home screen, and I wanna show you that within those codecs, you can choose your gamma space. You can choose either Rec 709, which means the color is baked in, the color is beautiful on the Alexa, and for many clients, that's great. If you're going to do extensive color correction, you can choose Log C. Log C is what I call, call raw-like. It is not data, it is actually video, but it's video with essentially a low contrast curve. So the amount of detail you can pull out of the blacks and the highlights is, is stunning. The advantage of Log C is you can apply the Rec. 709 look to all of your footage, or you can color correct it scene by scene. Frames per second, you can shoot up to 120 frames per second, except in 444, you can only shoot 60 frames per second. Audio is excellent. Shutter speed, you can choose whatever you want. This is the default, 172.8. Exposure index 800 is the baseline, meaning you have the same latitude in the highlights as you do in the lowlights. If you go to like 200 ASA, it's not cleaner. It is still extremely clean at 800. We've looked at color, Rec. 709, Log C. Let's go back. And white balances. You can choose a white balance. You can dial it in. We're going to just add one here. Let's do that. You can add magenta or you can add green. I usually shoot there, any more magenta, and skin tones get a little too red for my taste. Over here you have the info button, you have the time code button, uh, screen grabs. Very, very simple. There's more to it, but for the most part, that's the majority of the basics of the Alexa menu.